Well, no, really quality win. I mean, we beat a really fine basketball team tonight. Took a great effort to do it. Uh, I mean, I think, I think we beat an NCAA caliber team. I really do. You know, they won 23 games last year with the same team returning. Um, picked to win their league again this year. I think the record's a little deceiving because uh, Fowler, who's pretty good, by the way, you know, missed their first seven games. So uh, he makes a big difference when he's on the floor. But we, we really beat a quality team tonight. Uh, yeah, it was a great game to play in. Uh, they really push in transition. Um, Coach expressed that to us the entire time. Uh, and we didn't get it done first half, obviously. Um, second half, uh, we did a lot better with it. And uh, yeah, it was a real up-tempo game. So it was a fun game to play in. Yeah, what a stat line. I mean, 23 points, eight rebounds, 10 of 12 from the free throw line, four assists, one turnover. Great night, great night. We actually played him at the point a number of times tonight, and we've done that several times lately, not because we don't believe in our point guards, but we're doing it to get um, Connor and Greg, those guys on the floor a little bit more. They were great. I mean, Connor was terrific today. In fact, he shoots the ball so well. Was he four for six from three tonight, I think. When he missed the two, we were all shocked. You know, we were all disappointed and shocked that he missed the shot. But uh, and our guys did a really nice job of getting him the ball tonight. You know, we, there were several possessions. I think I can't remember who all did it. I think maybe David Cohn one time, Omar late, gave up a shot to get it to Connor. You know, they just have that much faith in him. So he was good. Greg Malinowski was good. Not as good as he has been in some days, but – you know, it's hard. It's two pretty good players that we're, we're not starting right now. And, uh, you know, we, we're having trouble at times getting them enough minutes. Uh, because to play them, you got to take Daniel Dixon or Omar Pruitt or somebody like that out of the lineup. I mean, I think they've all gotten really comfortable in playing in the college game. I mean, it's a big step from high school to college. Uh, it was for me. And, uh, I mean, this year they're all experienced sophomores. And um, Connor Birchfield's been playing just amazing lately. I mean, been shooting the ball great. Uh, Greg's been playing well, but yeah, our bench has been really solid this year. Yeah, Terry does so much for us. I mean, he's, you know, made made some shots tonight, which was neat to see, and uh, I felt really good with him on the foul line there late in the game. Uh, surprised he missed the first one, but had a lot of confidence he'd make that second one. He's playing really well. I mean, it's a really cool achievement to um, get a thousand points. Uh, I know not too many people do that, but um, you know, I mean, as long as our team wins, it's the biggest thing for me. It is a tough week. I mean, no question about it. Uh, we've played a high caliber team today. We have about a day and a half to get ready for a very good Towson team, uh, who I think is nine and three or something like that. Uh, you know, very talented team, very different team than we played tonight. This was a this was a team that is a perimeter oriented team. Towson is big, strong, physical, going to beat the heck out of us inside, rebound the ball as well as anybody in the country. So. Uh, very important that we get some rest between now and, and 1 o'clock on Thursday. So, uh, you know, our toughness will really be tested.